What is going on guys? So today I'm going to show you how to open a file path in terminal in Windows 11. So <clears throat> here I have the file explorer open and I want to open this exact file path in a terminal. So there's a simple way to do this now. You can just right click within the file explorer and then just click open in terminal. And this brings you right to the exact file path that you're in. So it'll go users, my name, and then music, and then no copyright music. So that brings me into my music folder here. And that is the simplest way to do it, to be honest. Like you can just go into any uh, folder you want and then just right click and you can do open in terminal. So if you don't have this option for some reason, um, you can always do, um, you can just type in terminal here and then you can um, just go to the file path that you want. So say you want to open this file path, you can right click up here, you can do copy address as text and then you can do CD space and then do control V to paste the address, then hit enter and you will now be in this file path as well. So that's another way how to do it. If that doesn't work, you might be in a different drive. So for example, if there's a D drive, which might be like your hard drive and you have a solid state, type in this first. It looks for the drive. I don't have one of those. I only have solid state on this computer. But if it were there, it would switch me to the D drive and then I could do CD and that. So that is two ways I had to do it. Um, you can do the same thing in command prompt as well. So if you do CMD. This is, I guess, Windows' old version of Terminal. <laughs> it's just, I don't know what they're doing with their apps nowadays. But yeah, you could just do the same thing here. So if you do copy address as text, and then you do CD, Control V, boom, brings you right into the thing. Yeah, And same thing, if you have a hard drive, you do exactly what I just showed you on Terminal. You do the drive, and then you do CD, and you go into the file path. So that's how you do it. Um, hopefully you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please drop a like, and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching, guys.